In the intricate dance of human relationships, there comes a time when one realizes the depth of their emotions for another. Your person, the one who holds a special place in your heart, has reached this point of realization. They have stopped distracting themselves from the profound emotions they harbor towards you. No matter how far they run or how long they try to escape, they've come to understand that nothing can replace the love they have for you. It's a love that's deep, enduring, and irreplaceable. It's a love that has become a part of their existence. However, this realization has come with its share of pain. After pushing you away, they're feeling a deep sense of hurt. They understand that you don't want to be stuck in an uncertain situation. You're seeking stability, a sense of security, and most importantly, a partner with whom you can create a stable and happy life. You're seeking a love that's not just about passion, but also about companionship, understanding, and mutual growth. Now, they're grappling with feelings of insecurity. You're not expressing your love towards them as you used to, and this has left them feeling unsettled. They were never used to feeling disconnected from you. From the moment you came into their life, you became an integral part of their world. But now, when you pulled back, they're seeing the repercussions of their actions. They're seeing how immaturely they were handling things with you. This is the time when your person is actually acknowledging and accepting their mistakes. They're seeing the error of their ways and are coming to terms with the consequences of their actions. Your person is now in a state of waiting. They're waiting for a sign from you, a glimmer of hope that you're still interested in them. They're hoping that you're not walking away from this connection, this bond that you both have nurtured over time. They're hoping that despite everything, there's still a chance for them to make amends, to rectify their mistakes, and to rekindle the love that you both once shared. Meanwhile, you're focusing on your life. You're enjoying all the little moments that life has to offer. You're celebrating the success you've achieved through your hard work. You're living your life to the fullest, finding happiness in things beyond this relationship. This is sending your person a clear sign that you have other things in your life that bring you happiness as well. It's showing them that while they hold a special place in your heart, they're not your entire world. The dynamics of your relationship with your person are changing. They're learning from their mistakes, acknowledging their feelings, and hoping for a second chance. And you, on the other hand, are finding happiness in your own life, showing them that you're more than just a part of their world. This is the journey of love, filled with realizations, growth, and the hope for a better tomorrow. It's a journey that's unique to each one of us, teaching us invaluable lessons about love, life, and relationships. Every time we part ways and spend time in solitude, I notice a transformation in you that is so profound it renders you almost unrecognizable to me. It's as if the act of being alone, the act of spending time with oneself, fuels your growth in a way that is both beautiful and awe-inspiring. You seem to blossom in solitude, becoming more confident, more radiant, and more attractive with each passing moment. It's as if the energy you invest in yourself during these periods of solitude is returned to you tenfold 
manifesting itself in the form of increased self-assuredness and an allure that is impossible to ignore. However, my experience is starkly different. When you withdraw your energy from me, when you retreat into your shell and focus on nurturing your own growth, I find myself feeling drained. I feel tired, dull, and low, as if a vital source of energy has been abruptly cut off. This shift in energy, dynamics triggers a surge of anxiety within me, a feeling of unease that is primarily rooted in my lack of confidence in your presence. To mask this insecurity, to hide this side of me that I'm not proud of, I often resort to arrogance. I put up a facade, a wall of false, bravado, in an attempt to hide my true feelings. But deep down, I know that this is just a defense mechanism, a way for me to cope with the discomfort that arises from feeling vulnerable and exposed. There are moments when I feel like you understand me better than I understand myself. You have this uncanny ability to reveal aspects of my personality that I was previously oblivious to. You hold up a mirror to my soul, showing me parts of myself that I was completely unaware of. Although these revelations can be triggering, they ultimately contribute to my personal growth. They force me to confront parts of myself that I would rather ignore, pushing me out of my comfort zone and encouraging me to grow and evolve. I find myself drawn to your energy, almost fixated on it. It's as if you're the only one who truly understands me and my feelings. You see through my facade, you see through my arrogance, and you see me for who I truly am. This realization, while overwhelming, is also profoundly comforting. It reassures me that I'm not alone, that there's someone out there who truly gets me. But this fixation on your energy also comes with its own set of challenges. It makes me overly reliant on you for validation and approval. It makes me feel like I'm constantly walking on eggshells, constantly trying to live up to your expectations. It makes me feel like I'm constantly trying to prove myself, constantly trying to show you that I'm worthy of your attention and affection. Our relationship is a complex web of emotions, insecurities, and growth. It's a journey of self-discovery, a journey of learning to navigate the complexities of human emotions and relationships. It's a journey that is both challenging and rewarding, a journey that has taught me more about myself than I could have ever imagined. And for that, I am eternally grateful. In the midst of a world that is constantly in flux, your partner finds themselves in a state of heightened emotion. It's as if they are carrying a heavy burden, a weight that is both profound and deeply personal. This emotional state is not one of despair or sadness, but rather, it is a testament to the depth of their feelings for you. They yearn for a quiet, undisturbed time alone with you, a sanctuary where the world outside ceases to exist, and it's just the two of you. Your partner's emotions are not rooted in a sense of dependency or neediness. Instead, they stem from a feeling of completeness that they experience when they are with you. It's as if a piece of a jigsaw puzzle has fallen into place, making the picture whole. This feeling is so profound, so deeply ingrained in their being, that they vow never to let you go. They aspire to be your emperor, a figure of authority and protection, promising to protect and provide for you. 
your partner is well aware of your strength and independence. They know that you are fully capable of taking care of yourself. Yet, they can't help but feel protective over you. It's not a question of doubting your abilities, but rather, it's a testament to the depth of their feelings for you. They perceive you as a strong yet delicate individual, a paradox that only adds to your allure. You command their respect, not by demand, but by the sheer force of your personality and the respect you have for yourself. Your assertive step into your power has not gone unnoticed. It has shown them the high-value woman that you are. You are not afraid to stand up for yourself, to assert your needs and wants. This strength, this assertiveness, has only increased their admiration for you. They see you, as a woman of high value, a, woman who knows her worth, and isn't afraid to show it. Your partner is well aware of your character. They have seen your softness, your, sweetness, and the energy you radiate. These qualities, rather than making them feel threatened, have made them feel possessive towards you. They see these qualities not as weaknesses, but as strengths, as things, that make you uniquely you. Regardless of the pace at which your relationship is progressing, they want you to know that their desire is solely for you. Whether things are moving fast or slow, their focus remains on you. They are not interested, in anyone else, their desire, their focus, is solely on you. They want you to know this, to understand the depth of their feelings for you. In the vast tapestry of human relationships, I find myself constantly comparing you with others. It's an involuntary act, a subconscious process that I seem to have little control over. Yet, every time I make these comparisons, I end up at the same conclusion, you are different. You are unique. You are unlike anyone I've ever encountered or experienced in my life. Your individuality is not just refreshing, it's captivating, drawing me, in like a moth to a flame. When you're not around, when you're Physical presence is not gracing my surroundings, I seek solace in your pictures. They are not just images to me, they are portals, gateways through which I attempt to establish a connection with you. I look at them, study them, lose myself in them, trying to decipher the enigma that is you. It's as if I can hear your voice in my mind a soft whisper that echoes in the silence, engaging in a conversation with me. It's not just any conversation, it's a dialogue that transcends the boundaries of time and space. This connection, this bond that seems to have formed between us, is truly enchanting. It's magical, like a spell that has been cast, enveloping me in its allure. It's a connection that is hard to put into words, a relationship that is as complex as it is simple. I'm perplexed, bewildered even, as to why you can't comprehend the magnetic pull I feel towards, you. It's a force that is as undeniable as it is inexplicable. When you're immersed in your own world, when you're lost in your thoughts, your actions, your inherent softness comes to the fore. It's a softness that is not a sign of weakness, but a testament to your strength. It's a softness that compels me, urges me to assert my masculine energy in your life. It's a dance of energies, a balance of yin and yang that creates a harmony that is both beautiful and profound. 
You've managed to stir something within me, something that I've kept concealed from the world. You've awakened my gentleness, a side of me that I've kept hidden under layers of masculinity. It's a gentleness that is not weak, but strong, a gentleness that is not timid, but bold. With each passing day, my feelings for you intensify, growing stronger and deeper. It's a feeling that is as exhilarating as it is terrifying, a feeling that is, as new as it is familiar. All I can say is that you are unlike anyone I've ever known. You are a mystery that I am eager to unravel, a puzzle that I am determined to solve. You are a journey that I am excited to embark on, a destination that I am longing to reach. You are, in every sense of the word, unique, and that is what makes you, you.